Hey everybody, it's Scott for JohnJesBeat.com and we are at Pro Wrestling Blitz. We're going to talk with second generation superstar Buddy Roberts Jr. What's going on, man? Not too much. Just had a good match tonight. Hey, listen, uh, obviously, the name Buddy Roberts Jr., everybody already knows, your dad. Uh, what was it like growing up in kind of like an, under the Freebird Helm? Uh, Freebird Helm, it, it was a lot of fun. Uh, my dad was crazy all the time. Uh, he stopped wrestling when I was really young, so I wasn't really around the business as far as when my dad was wrestling. I was a little baby, so I can't really remember that. But uh, just having my dad as you know there for me and teaching me things that are about psychology, which is the most important thing, and that's where I've learned the most from him. And so. Now, obviously, okay, you obviously probably saw tapes of your dad wrestling. Of course, a lot of the guys. So having your dad as one of the great wrestlers, when do you know it? What age you go, I'm following him? Uh, I've always wanted to be a wrestler. And, like, in high school and grade school, you know, you would fill out those papers and say, what do you want to be? You know, a lot of people said fireman. And I always put pro wrestler. And a lot of people, you know, made fun of me as I was growing up. And a lot of people understood that my dad wrestled. But it's something that I followed. I followed my dream. And... I didn't start wrestling until I was 23 years old, and it's because the whole time I'm thinking, like, I want to be a wrestler, but do I want to do the training? And I'm like, okay, you know what? I'm signing up. I want to start being a wrestler. I want to be a wrestler now. I can't, I can't wait any longer. Now, how long have you been in the business? Oh, four years now. Okay. Now, this, this, besides your dad, did you have any influences to get you into this? Uh, one of my major influences was Shawn Michaels. I love Shawn Michaels. I, I mean, I would dress up like Shawn Michaels watching the pay-per-views. I'd walk down the hallway and do his little poses and everything. Uh, Razor Ramon, uh, Scott Hall was one of my favorites. Macho Man. Uh, I, I'm really lucky to see a lot of old school stuff now, not like as far as DVDs, so I can go back in history and see like, okay, so I did my history and there's a lot of guys that influence my re my current wrestling now as far as like the Freebirds. I really like to try to work with like now, A lot of our regular viewers know we do a lot of work with Pro Wrestling Blitz out of Joliet. How did you wind up here? Uh, last January, I got a call from a guy that works here now. His name is Justin Reno. He's wrestling under Judas now. He said, hey, what are you doing next Saturday? I said, I have no plans. He was like, well, Tony Scarpone asked me to wrestle for them for a tryout match. And he said, find a partner. He was like, Dude, would you be my partner? So I was like, absolutely. And here I am, like 13 months later, and I fight him in, you know, with Paul Bear as my manager in a bad street match. Yeah, that was great. Hey, listen, uh, we want to really talk about something that's coming up that's going to be really cool. We want people to check this out. Come on down for it. Uh, April 26th and 27th. Uh, that is the last full weekend in April, is, uh, is, is the Buddy Roberts six-man mm -hmm. tag team tournament. I want Tell everybody about that. Uh, this is a six-man tournament. I think there's going to be 15, 16 three-man teams, and the, 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 the six-man team that wins the tournament is, is for, it's going to be called the Buddy Roberts Memorial Tournament, and all the proceeds uh, go to... A charity of my dad's choice, which we decided was going to be an animal shelter. It's called uh, Lake Forest Animal Shelter in uh, University Park. Uh, great place. I've, I've, you know, I got all of our animals. It's a no-kill shelter. Uh, this this place does, is awesome. I mean, I, I, I highly recommend this place. They're so nice. They save people's animals. Don't charge them money half the time. So uh, this is a really good cause. What, what, what drew your dad to that charity? Uh, my dad just loved animals. I mean. We, we, we thought about maybe for the Cancer Society, and we've, you know, tons of people give those guys money all the time. And, I mean, we love, you know, supporting, you know, people who have cancer. But as far as animals, I, I just know my dad would really approve of helping others, you know, that want to adopt animals or have pets. Now, people who want to follow the tournament and want to follow you professionally, where can they find you online? Uh, you can find me at Brandon Hay on Facebook. You can find me at Brandon Hay on Twitter. So... We also want to encourage everybody to go to uh, ProWrestlingBlitz.com. Keep your eyes out August, or, I'm sorry, April 26th and 27th for the Buddy Roberts Memorial Six-Man Tag Team Tournament. Buddy Roberts Jr. will be there, and I wouldn't bet against him going all the way. Just wait till you guys see who my teammates are going to be. Can't tell you, but it's going to be good. It's going to be real good. All right. Thanks for joining us, man. I appreciate it. No problem.